So for the last 20 years, Veris Technologies has been making soil mapping equipment. And primarily we've been mapping, making this equipment as, as soil mapping carts or, or toolbars that you pull through the field as a, as a mapping pass. The demand for this type of technology, these type of maps has been growing consistently. So to answer that demand, we're introducing at the Louisville Farm Show, the National Farm Machinery Show, what we call the eye scan. The eye scan is a, is a sensor that maps soil texture using soil EC and soil organic matter optically. And what this device does is it mounts on a planner or tillage tool so that you're collecting this data while you're doing a normal tillage pass. So it features the same proven Veris soil EC and soil optical uh, technology as our, as our cart-based units, but allows you to collect the data reasonably effortlessly. Well, there's an increasing demand for, for precise variable rate seeding maps, for, for corn population, for multi-hybrid planting, uh, increasing interest in, in, in fine-tuning nitrogen management. So these types of applications require a precise soil map. Soil survey is not going to do it. You know, a bunch of remote imagery is not going to really be a soil map. So you need to give, actually touch the soil and actually measure the soil if you're going to manage nitrogen and seed. So certainly the more that the, we put the, uh, the accessibility of these maps in growers' hands and their consultants' hands, the more that this is just going to increase the adoption. This device injects electrical current into the soil with two electrodes. The front coulter and the rear closing disc are the, the uh, electrodes that inject electrical current. And then these two chromium carbide points detect the electrical array after it's gone down in the soil about two feet. So with that configuration, you're measuring soil texture uh, pretty much throughout the rooting profile. And then this back runner has an a, uh, optical sensor built into it. You can't see it here in the soil, so we put an extra one on here just to, uh, to show what that looks like. But basically, we're shining a red and infrared light down in the soil and about two inches deep. So we're measuring the soil optical properties which relate to organic matter uh, on the go. It's available this spring in limited quantities.